Welcome back to my Keep Up channel. Shock as two trend Aragua gangsters jailed for terrorizing Denver suburb are allowed to walk out of jail and roam free in Colorado. Two thugs from the notorious Venezuelan gang Trenda Aragua arrested in Colorado for a shooting are free and on the streets in Aurora, Colorado, DailyMail.com can reveal. Dixon Azuich Perez, 20, and Nixon Azuich Perez, 19, are two of four Trenda Aragua gang members arrested by local police in recent days for an attempted murder on July 28 that occurred at the Nome Street Apartments. It's one of the apartment buildings overtaken by armed members of South American mob. Aurora police confirmed Dixon and Nixon are no longer in jail. Nixon and Dixon both posted $1,000 bond on their charges, a police spokesman told DailyMail.com. They are no longer in custody. Both Dixon and Nixon are described as suspected members of TDA, as the gang is known to federal law enforcement officials. Meanwhile, John Erdy de Jesus Pacheco Chirinos, 24, and his brother John Erdy Jose Pacheco Chirinos, also known as Cookie or Galetta, are known gang members. They were arrested in connection with the same shooting and are in the custody of Immigration and Customs Enforcement. TDA is best known for its brutal sex trafficking of women and girls in South America, as well as its smuggling of their own countrymen. A bombshell report details the complete control the criminal organization had on the Whispering Pine apartments in the Denver suburb. Vacant units had reportedly been used to host parties where the gang provided drug and child prostitution, according to the apartment's manager, who added that the gangster said minors are a good source of money. The notorious South American gang arrived in the U.S. in recent years, as Daily Mail was first to report, mixed in with asylum-seeking migrants. They have been linked to a crime wave stretching from Miami to New York. In recent days, the Dallas Police Department has confirmed its hunting TDA members in the Texas city. TDA established its new headquarters on the U.S.-Mexico border, just south of El Paso, Texas, as DailyMail.com exclusively reported. In Texas' sixth-largest city, about a nine-hour drive from Dallas, police are working on a confidential plan to address the growing threat, insiders told DailyMail.com last month. As a DailyMail.com investigation revealed, Venezuelan migrants have infiltrated food delivery and rideshare apps, renting or buying accounts that do not belong to them and showing up at your door illegally. In July, the U.S. government designated TDA as a transnational criminal organization. Today's designation of Trenda Aragua as a significant transnational criminal organization underscores the escalating threat it poses to American communities, Under Secretary for Terrorism and Financial Intelligence Brian Nelson said last month. TDA's leader remains on the run, with a $5 million bounty on his head. Dubbed the epitome of evil, the notorious criminal organization Trenda Aragua, or TDA as it is known by federal agents, previously operated out of an infamous South American prison. But after kingpin Hector Guerrero Flores escaped last year, the mafia moved its command center to Ciudad Juarez in Mexico on the U.S. border, directly across from El Paso, Texas, local officials told DailyMail.com. Trenda Aragua is the epitome of evil, Congressman Tony Gonzalez, who represents El Paso, said. This gang is known to rape children, spearhead murders, and cause widespread chaos. Since forming behind the walls of the Tocaron prison in the Venezuelan state of Aragua, Trenda Aragua, Spanish for Train of Aragua, is now linked to widespread human and sex trafficking on the South American continent. Law enforcement now considers the gang as dangerous as El Salvador's Mara Salvatruca, or MS-13. Source, DailyMail.co.uk Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.